Hi. I'll just wait for people to start joining before I start waffling on at you. got a few people please um if you if you're watching can you comment just so that i can see that um see who's here and say hello to you don't be shy i like to talk okay we've got five people now eight people and seven right i'll start waffling at you then again please feel free to talk to me ask, ask me any questions that you want while we're doing this is only a short live Hi Debbie, how are you? Um, thank you for coming. Um, so, uh, it's just a short one tonight, just to go through a few products with you. Um, if I'm a bit, if I'm talking a bit funny, I'm really sorry. I've got two ear infections. You couldn't make that up, could you? Not just one, I've got two ear infections, so I can't actually hear, so I don't know how loud I'm talking, which is really bad for me. Anybody that knows me knows how bad that is, because I'm quite loud anyway. Um, so, for anybody that doesn't know me, um, my name's Bonnie. I'm a makeup artist based in Nottingwell, so a HD brow stylist um, and a lash artist. Um, so I do a lot of reviews, um, makeup tutorials online, primarily on an amazing group called Mrs Gloss and the Goss. Please all feel free to head over and like the Mrs Gloss page, it's incredible and you'll love it. The best beauty group on the planet. Um, so that's who I am, that's what I do and um, I'm now going to be working with Cherry Berry, um, just so that I can show you some of their amazing products and tell you a little bit about them. Um, so cherryberry.com, cherryberrycosmetics.com. Um, I know Debbie, how bad is that? Um, there is a fantastic website, they stock all sorts of high end, if you don't already know about them, um, they stock all sorts of high end makeup um, from Urban Decay, NARS, um, Benefit, YSL, Becca, um, some amazing brands and they are, some of the stuff is heavily discounted. Um, so. Is, is fantastic so if you're ever looking for any kind of makeup any high-end makeup it's always worth going onto the cherry berry website first just to see if they've got what you're after or something similar to what you're after because you will pick it up cheaper than you would at debenhams or or somewhere like that on the high street okay so let's get started so what i'm going to be showing you today we're just going to we're just going to put a bit of a base on um so i've got a benefit professional primer which is amazing really good for your skin for a few reasons and i'll go through that with you but i'm going to be putting the very highly talked about um ysl two chocolate um foundation um i use b30 in this which is a great shade for me because i like to be a little bit darker Please feel free to talk up anybody, just so that I'm not talking at you. It's nice to talk with you. Um, and then we're going to be going in with the, which is my favourite product on the planet, I'm not even lying. This is just beautiful. This is the Becca um, Shimmering Skin Perfector Slim Light Champagne Pop Highlighter. It's like a cream highlighter. I'll show you that. It's absolutely beautiful. And I'm going to be putting a few of the products on with um, some of Cherry Berry's amazing oval brushes. If you can see those really good for a flawless finish so these oval brushes they're great for putting um liquids and powders on particularly liquids and as you'll see you get such a good coverage because the bristles i'll show you because of the way that the bristles are tightly compact into a small area so you can see how many bristles there are on that brush it gives you a very very firm surface to actually apply your makeup so that's a really really good tool so what i'm going to do to start with i'm just going to use a slightly smaller oval brush which is this one you can see they're really they're rose gold they're really really pretty um, and i'm just going to use a little bit of the professional so the professional for me is great for a few reasons now i use this a lot um obviously use it as a primer now the good thing about the primer is that it, it fills your pores, so it doesn't fill your pores so, so that they're clogged and, and heavy. It's a really silky smooth product. So if you have got slightly enlarged pores, which I have, um, you can see that I have got quite large pores. Um, it just gives you a better surface to, to work on. Hi Becky. I'm just waffling away. <laughs> Do you love it L? Is it L, L-A? I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, but it's a great product. Um, professional, it's brilliant. So it's great to go under your foundation 
or if for people that don't actually particularly like wearing a lot of foundation it's great on its own you, you can't you just can't imagine how silky soft this product is when you put it on your skin on its own it just gives your skin a completely flawless finish um, so even if you're not going to go ahead and then put foundation on i use this a lot on mother of the brides and um, so when i'm doing bridal makeup and i'm doing the, the mothers that a lot of mothers that I, I tend to go to don't particularly want to wear foundation they don't want to look too heavy so all i do is i just give them a really nice finish with just using the professional so you know it's for everybody no it's not just you know for people that want to have a good base for their foundation it's for everyone i've got a really itchy nose so i'm going to go ahead and put that on so i'm just going to use um the medium size oval brush and you can see i've just put a little splodge on my hand it's not a huge amount and i'm just going to gently work that into my skin It really does give a fab base, Becky. Um, and, and again, like I say, as a standalone product, it's it's absolutely brilliant as a standalone product. So just working that nicely into the skin. I can't even, if you've never used this product, I can't even begin to tell you how beautifully it goes on because it's so soft. It makes your skin feel so smooth it's beautiful well thank you all for joining me anyway we're going to go ahead and do this tonight and then if you all want to see me again i think we're going to go and do a full face next time so hopefully you'll be able to come and see me again i'm just going to use a teeny weeny bit more you really don't need a lot of this either it goes a very long way and then just working that into my forehead it's got a really nice matte finish to it as well. Okay, so I'm just going to give that a minute just to settle into my skin. And then we'll go ahead and put the foundation on. Now, I'm having a very bad skin week, as you can see. Which is great, actually. Bit of a weirdo. I actually quite like it when I have a bad skin week when I'm doing a live. Because when I'm doing a foundation application, it shows you how good the coverage is, so you'll see how good that coverage is. So I'm just going to let that set into my skin and if when you touch your skin it just it's just beautiful. It's such a beautiful finish. Okay, okay. So, we're now going to use the um YSL Touche Clot, which is a beautiful foundation. Now, the first thing that you notice about this when you open it is the smell. It smells gorgeous. Really, really nice. As do all YSL products actually coming to think of it. So I'm just going to put a little dab on my hand and we're going to go in with the big oval brush to do this. So just get a little bit on your brush and just start working that into your skin. So you can see already the beautiful finish that this foundation's got. It's so good. And remember those spots on my cheek? We won't be able to see those in a moment. It is huge, honestly. This bottle of foundation, I wear makeup every day. I reckon it would last me a year. I'm not even joking. It's absolutely huge. I'll show you in a minute. It's 125 mils, so to put it into perspective, a, a standard size bottle of foundation is 30 mils, and this is 125. So the RRP on that is 118 pound. Massive, mega bucks, and um, Cherry Berry sell it for 39.99. Absolutely, cannot go wrong. Yeah, Bex, definitely go and order one. I love the brushes, Becky. I mean, look, why would you not? Sorry, I've got my dodgy eye makeup on that's been on since like 7 o'clock this morning. So yeah, the foundation, 39.99, which is only marginally more than you would pay for a 30ml bottle of pretty much any high-end foundation. Um... um 
12 months you've got 12 months to use it so i don't know if anybody knows i'm going to show you so we've got any any cosmetics if you look on the bottle you see that little part with the lid open there I don't know if you can see the number. No, it's a bit blurry. Um, all cosmetics have got that. So that will tell you what the shelf life is after you've opened it. So this has got 12 months. You will, I, I will use that in 12 months easily. Um, so it's worth... Um, it's definitely worth getting. It's worth its weight in gold. I can't believe how cheap it is. Um, You can see the brushes, how beautifully, and it just, the product just slides across your face, it's so good. It's got a very dewy finish. Oh, I love Tien Idol. It's very similar. It smells very similar as well, Nicole. Honestly, Tien Idol is one of my favourites, and I would put this easily up there. It's got a fantastic coverage. Um, it smells great, just like the Tien Idol from um, Lancome. Um... And actually, do you know what? This is a really good match. This colour, this is B30. This is a really good match for, I think it's number three in Tien Idol. So if anyone's looking for a reference point, um, that's what I am in that as well. Yeah, it smells great. This smells actually, I think this one. Generally, you find that the Tien Idol is really strong. Um, I find it really strong like it, it the fumes from it actually hurt my eyes a little bit I don't know whether I've just got really sensitive eyes um but I find it really strong this isn't this is like it feels really moisturizing on your skin so it's got a really beautiful dewy finish so for anyone that's not in particularly interested in that matte look which at the minute I'm not I'm all about a dewy finish I've got dewy setting sprays and everything and you can see the coverage is fantastic and it does give you that nice, dewy, fresh, pretty look, which I, th I find really nice in a minute. So just to recap on those two that we've used so far. So we've used the um, Benefit Professional, which are the RRP on that. I have got everything written down. The RRP on that is 26 and uh, Cherry Berry sell it for 22 99 So you've got around about a £3 saving. Could you just swatch up all of the colours? I couldn't personally, but I don't know whether we can get that arranged for you, Bex. You can, however, if you're struggling to find, figure out what colour foundation you need, there's an amazing website called foundation.com. So instead of foundation, it's foundation. And all you do, yes, we do sell the brushes, Claire. I'm just going to come on to that in a moment, sweet. Um, so all you do with foundation.com is you put in your shades of other foundations that you are. So for instance, I would put in I Am Ivory Beige in Estee Lauder Double Wear. Um, and then it will bring up um it will bring up any uh, the, whatever you're looking for it will bring up what color you should be in that so it's quite a good tool to use um flashback it's spf 22 which is quite high um i haven't actually taken a photo just yet so i'm not too sure how i would get on with flashback it's quite high in spf so i would have thought we would get some flashback yeah um but it's dewy so might be all right um the um so that's the so right so professional so that's that so you've got around a three pound saving on the professional on the cherry berry website compared to what you would pay high street um so that's a really good saving on that the foundation um which again is a massive 125 mil bottle a normal standard foundation bottle is 30 mil um you do need this foundation it is beautiful hitting your supplies they are maxine i think i think maxine's gonna be hitting you not you personally your website oh my god she's definitely not hitting you <laughs> um so that's that's massive um for 39 39.99 which is what eight pound more than you'd pay for a bottle of double wear which is that big literally that's the difference it's got a 12 month shelf life on it so you'll easily get it used um and it are the rrp on that is 118 pounds that is a massive it's around about an 80 pound saving for a ysl foundation i mean really why wouldn't you it's a no-brainer um the brushes again so the oval brushes these are cherry berries um so they are 19.99 and there is this it's a set of five um, so there's lots that you can use there for different things and they're really multifunctional as well you can use them for eyeshadow you can use them for highlighting um, they're, they're really really good brushes so that's that now I'm just going to quickly go on to um, the 
Becca Slim Light Champagne Pop. This is amazing. For anybody that's wanting that super glowy, dewy, beautiful, fresh, gorgeous look at the minute, this is what you need. I'm not even joking. It gives you life. Beautiful. So, it's like um, retractable. So it's a bit of cream on a pencil. So, there's a few ways you can do this. It's entirely up to you. You could try and use a brush. Oh, God, how good is Becca? Seriously. And the champagne pop, it's literally... Get, I'm not joking, it gives my face life. Um, so if you take a look at the minute, I've got a, sh a slight sheen on, my, on the top of my cheek just from the... Because, the like, like I say, the dewiness from the... Um, uh, looking forward to it. Sorry, I'm just reading some going along. So I've got a little bit of a sheen on my face at the minute, just probably because that's quite a dewy finish anyway. But you'll see in a moment quite how much this this works. It's such a good product. So all I'm going to do, I'm going to use my finger with this. Actually, you can just draw it on like this, wherever you want it. So I always go for the tops of my cheekbones, anywhere that the sun and light would naturally hit tip of my nose, bridge of my nose, and Cupid's bow around the top of my lip line and a little bit on the top of my chin. Okay, so now all I'm going to do is just go in with my finger and just blend that out. Just dab him. Yeah, slim like Chloe. It's so good. And it just, I mean, I love powders, but I just find that these give you, like I say, for those people that are looking for that really fresh, dewy look, I mean, look at that shine. So good. It just gives you that perfect bit of light. And because it's a cream formula, it stays looking fresh and dewy. So with your highlighter, what I always say is try and go like in an S shape around your eye. So starting from there, so you can see it goes down here, across here and down there. So always in like an S shape. So I'm just dabbing that in just to blend that nicely into the skin. Would it work over powder, do you think? No, I use it over powder. If I was using a powder, see, I'm not. I'm going for a dewy look, so I wouldn't be using a powder. But if I was going for, if I was using a setting powder, then I would do exactly the same thing. The only thing I wouldn't do is I wouldn't draw it on. What I would do is just put some on my fingertip like that, and then dab it over. Or you can put it on before your powder. It's still going to show through your powder if it's a translucent setting powder. Um, so yeah, definitely, it's it's a really versatile product. And look shine you see it's just beautiful such a good highlighter really really pretty and worth its weight in gold I mean I took this out with me on Saturday night and I spent all night highlighting people's faces they thanked me a lot I don't just go around touching random people's faces by the way <laughs> Um, so that's the Becca um, Slim Light Highlighter. So that, the RRP on that is £25 and on Cherry Berry it's £18.99 which is around about a £6 saving. Um, it's, Laura, it's the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector Slim Light in the colour is Champagne Pop. So a lot of people use this in the powder form. I love this for a dewy look um, because it's cream formula and not powder. Um, but the colour is just incredible. I don't know if you can see it's really no I can't show you because the light is too bright but it's beautiful anyway it's called champagne pop and it looks a bit like champagne pop so there we go it says, it says what it is um so yeah that's that so that's that's all we're going for today so you can see what a fresh dewy look I mean you put a little bit of bronzer on your cheeks and a little bit of blusher and you're good to go and you, you're just gonna look so fresh and clear and glowy that's what we want everybody this summer is going for glowy um highlighters on massive dewy effect um 
foundations are massive that's what everybody's asking for at the moment so these products really do shine through for those reasons this summer um so has anybody got any other questions before i love you and leave you and go and nurse my poorly ears i think i've done well today i'm quite poorly i'll just wait to see if anyone's got any questions and then i shall leave you all to your evening but hopefully we'll be doing another one and we'll do what we'll probably do next time is go for a full face that'd be fun could waffle at you for even longer <laughs> okay no one's coming through with any questions so thanks claire oh i'm doing claire's bridal makeup soon aren't i claire i'm so excited <laughs> i love doing wedding makeup it's one of my favorites see again these products for, for bridal makeup Love this dewy look, Becky, Hennis Chowberry, nice order. Oh, that's fantastic. Um, yeah, full face. Love a good full face, bit of a contour. <gasps> See, Debbie knows me. Debbie knows me from Mrs. Gloss and I do sing sometimes. I'm tone deaf. I literally, I'm not joking, Debbie, I'm totally deaf in my left ear. Cannot hear a thing out of my left ear at the minute and my right ear is just getting worse. So all I've done for the last two days is what people this kind of look for your wedding in three weeks oh laura that's amazing well look i mean I, by all means i will take some photos of my face and see how see what the flashback's like have you not got a makeup artist or anything booked and are you doing your own makeup um but yeah this is this is what i mean you get a really nice pink blusher like um benefit dandelion get that on these cheeks honestly it's um it's a winner for bridal makeup just always put your, your smile Put your blush out like this. Beautiful pink. Um, I think cherry berry. Becky, do you do the dandelion blusher? Benefit dandelion. Um, because if she does, it's incredible. It's literally the best blusher on the planet. Um, perfect for bridal. It's the perfect pink. Um, oh, have you got it? Ah, does it look half as good though? Ah, oh, I wonder why. That's strange. Perhaps you, it I suppose it depends what products you're using it with, maybe. That can make a massive difference. Oh, look at my big foundation lips. Um, so, I don't think anyone's got any more questions. If you have, just fire them at me quickly. I've got an itchy nose. Thanks for listening to me waffle. It's been amazeballs. I hope you've all enjoyed it. And we'll come back again soon. Um, but yeah, if you've got any other questions, just pop them on the thread and I'll, um, I'll try and answer anything as best as I can for you after, after the live. I have put on the, um, description of the live feed what I've used. Um, oh, oh, I see. Right. Sorry. I, right. You've got a makeup artist, but she doesn't look as good. Right. Okay. She used Mac on you. Estee Lauder Normandy. Estee Lauder is not very good for bridal makeup because it gets horrendous flashback on flash photography. Um, so I wouldn't recommend using that anyway. Mac's great for bridal makeup. It is good. I personally, I, I use NARS foundations on brides although i am going to check the flashback on this because if it's good if there's no not a lot of flashback which i don't know whether there will be or not um then i might actually start using that <laughs> why wouldn't i look at the size of that bottle <laughs> it's a winner um but yeah so i mean if you're not happy with your makeup artist darling you need to maybe have a look around or tell her tell her most people are really nice about it um, I know I'd be devastated if, if my Claire told me she didn't like her makeup. You've got very dry skin. Make sure you really moisturise. Drink loads and loads of water running up to the day, Lauren. Ah, oh, Claire. I'm so excited for your try for your day. Um, I'm really looking forward to it. So, any more questions, just fire away. And if I've finished the live, then I'll try and come back and answer them all for you. Um, and it's been great. Thank you all for coming and talking to me and listening to me waffle and put a bit of makeup on. Um, and I will um, try and be back soon with a bit more makeup for you. A bit of a contour and stuff, maybe some eyes. Um, brows, everybody loves brows. Brows are my favourite. I love brows. Um, so I will love you all and leave you. Thank you so much for coming. And again, any questions, just fire away. And me and Becky will answer them for you. It's really lovely talking to you. Bye.